Hey, you going, you proud? I love your hat. How you going? What is it? I've got you a nice little little bag of stuff here. We started work yesterday, and as soon as we got in around 6 a.m., there was I think there was two jobs already on the system for a noise yeah. complaint in relation to a uh, rooster. As we've opened the door, we've heard crowing. So I was like, oh, this has got to be true. The, the reason because my son in hospital has leukemia stage 4. When he's back from the hospital, uh, my sister is bringing to gift for him the two small, like one chicken, one rooster. And uh, this happened like my son always look after the, the rooster and he's giving him the food. You're going to give him a name? He's like uh, Jackson. Jackson. Like Jackson. Jackson. Do you like Jackson? We've um, had a bit of a chat with the dad and he's told me that in the next 10 days the council wants to get rid of it and I, I've got a beautiful big farm out in Catherine Fields and there's plenty of room for um, the hit here and uh, the chicken to run around. Anytime you want to come down and see Jackson, you're more than welcome to come. Yeah. Okay, great. Frankie's only new out of the academy, so to hear how much the little bloke actually loved the rooster and for Frankie to be able to take the rooster and obviously give it a loving home, like, like it's amazing. Like it, it just goes above and beyond what I would expect from a constable uh, so fresh out of the academy. All I do is to strive to help people. Yep. And from the young age, I've always wanted to do that. And um, like I had a friend that had leukemia yeah. and that's, uh, that's the biggest thing is uh, when, when I heard about it, it uh, really hit home. Yeah. Yeah. Bye bye. Gonna say goodbye to Jackson? Oh, right. Bye Jackson. Yeah, bye. Yeah. Always here, right? And I hope everything goes all right, okay? All right? All good, little dude. No worries.